Let's begin our comprehensive coverage of this historic day with Alison Northcott in Quebec. The province that got things rolling this morning. Alison. Well, this long-term care home has had outbreaks in the first and second waves of the virus. Now it's among two homes in Quebec where residents got the vaccine today. Really, Madame Levesque? Powerful images we will see again and again. Giselle Levesque, the moment she became the first person in Canada to get the COVID-19 vaccine, captured in this video by Quebec's health ministry. Not long after, 78-year-old Gloria Laluz got her first shot. I feel fabulous. She lives at the Maimonides Geriatric Centre, where 15 people have died from the virus in the second wave alone. Everybody has to get a vaccination. It's the only way we're going to be able to live. The provincial and federal health ministers were both on hand to mark the significance. Our nation's been under trauma, so I see this as the first step forward into the light. Quebec plans to give the vaccine to nearly 5,000 people in the coming days, focusing on residents and staff in long-term care. They're giving it right now. Like so many events of the past months, Susan Lemko experienced this one remotely. Please tell him that I'm, that I'm very, very, very excited for him. On the line with her 95-year-old father's caregiver while he got the vaccine. Her father, Frank Lemkovich, caught COVID during the first wave. His daughter wants him vaccinated because she worries he could catch it again. He hasn't held his wife's hand since March. Within time, we can have hope now that my mother, who's 96, can come see my dad and that we can all be safe. My hope is everybody watched over this and they did it correctly. Beverly Spanier got her first dose today. Once she gets the second one, she looks forward to regaining some freedom. I had a friend in, in ICU. I couldn't even visit that person. I will not accept this anymore. I will have a big sign on me, vaccinated, let me out. The health authority says most residents here have agreed to be vaccinated and 150 were expected to get a shot today. The Quebec government says it plans to vaccinate up to 650,000 people by April 1st. But it's also reminding people that the pandemic is far from over because with the number of cases and hospitalizations continuing to grow, it says it remains critically important to follow public health measures. That's a good point. Alison Northcott, thank you.